Hello everybody and welcome to Boatscopy. Boatscopy live from the Boat Düsseldorf 2023. I'm in front of the Targa Boats booth. A big announce at uh, Botnia Marine, constructor of Targa, which announces a, a new model, the new Targa 41. Quite a revolution at, uh, at Targa. Let's meet Robert Carpellon, boss of Targa, to present us this new model. Hello, Robert. Hello, Nicolas. So it's, a, it's the beginning of a revolution at Targa. You announced a brand new model, uh, much more than a small evolution. You will uh, respect the DNA, but with strong changes, uh, specifically in the hull. But before, yeah, before explaining us this evolution and this new model, could you, uh, Robert, present us briefly Targa? Yes, uh, Targa was founded in, in 1979 uh, and it came to, to uh, Botnia Marine in 1984. In so Finland? In Finland, yes. So we have, uh, sh uh, very soon we have been producing the Targa boats for uh, close to 40 years. 40 years? Yes, so it's having a big, big and long tradition. Yeah. How many boats uh, uh, are sailing today? Uh, slightly more than 3,000 examples. 3,000 examples? Yes. What is specific in your DNA is uh, the design, the program of the boat, because uh, at the beginning you, you, you had commuter boats for professional activities. Yes, in the beginning it was very much uh, utilitarian, so it was a lot of, it was for fishing, it was for commuting, uh, and for some professional uses. Nowadays they are, uh, let's say, heavy duty uh, motor, yachts. Uh, motor yachts, yes. So heavy the duty motor yachts with semi-custom program. Yes, uh, almost all customers want to uh, put their own trademark on their own boat. So that's where we try to, to accommodate a lot of the client's wishes. What is unique at Targa is the fact you, you developed semi-custom motor yacht from uh, uh, 23 feet up to 46. Yes, and also we, we be, do build a lot of the boats in-house. So we, we, our possibilities to, to accommodate these uh, customizations is easier and more uh, flexible than many other boatyards. As we do glass fiber job, we do woodwork, we do electrical systems, we do, do the whole thing in-house. Yeah. Motor yacht, semi-custom, all weather motor yachts. Because you have very specific hulls, narrow hulls, but when you enter the waves, at uh, 14, 30 knots, yes. even if we have one meter or two meter waves, you go through. Yes, that is one of the uh, specific aspects of Targa and uh, something in the DNA to have the good sea performance and, and exactly as you say, uh, fairly, fairly narrow hulls compared to many of the, yeah. the traditional boats and uh, this is giving the great sea performance in, in heavy seas also. Second point uh, about uh, the specificity of the brand, the, the deck layout, very specific. It's a walk around yes. layout. Yes, uh, that has been uh, one of our trademarks from the very beginning. And today you see a lot of other boats uh, having the same concept. So Targa is, uh, let's say, some, somewhat of a, of a pioneer in that uh, type of boat, the wheelhouse uh, offshore boat uh, yeah the 46 is the biggest boat the flagship of the ranch correct uh, and on this uh, boat 2023 you announce brand new model the 41 when we discover the boat as a first vision they are not so strong evolution also also you announce a very important evolution in the specification and in the service on the, of the boat in comparison to the other model of the brand. The Targa design has always been and is still quite... Uh, design is here. <laughs> quite <laughs> it's not a question of design, Robert. <laughs> yes, uh, but uh, quite, uh, quite mo modest uh, design evolution. Yeah. And uh, we try to... For, for example, the glasses. 
Yes. I imagine that the, the technology of the glasses in comparison to such models is fully different. Yes. We have always uh, had the, the framed windows uh, yeah. unti until now. And, uh, but this, this new model will now ha have, the, have the slightly more modern uh, glue, glued windows. Like cars. Like cars and like, like a lot of the other players in the industry. You have more lights in the pilot, at piloting station too? Yes, so the glass, glass roof, which can either be a fixed roof or, or um, an openable one. Uh, the, 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 the larger uh, pilot house windows, yeah. slightly larger aft door, uh, larger um, windows in the aft cabin. The protection uh, of the cockpit, longer Ye protection of the cockpit. Yes, which can either f even further be extended by wow. e e e e e either soft top or hard yeah, top. Hard top too. But it's not the evolution. We all are. Uh, Gimmicks in terms of styling, the strong evolution is dealing with the hull. Could you explain us and explain to our viewers what you decide uh, to do, Robert? Because it's a strong evolution and you correct one criticize uh, people could do when they were looking at the target today. Well, for, for us, uh, for, for the target range, uh, the hull is wider than uh, maybe cl clients are used to. So for if we compare to the 37, which is uh, the model uh, just below this model, uh, the hull is... You have uh, a much wider hull. The hull is as much as... Than in the previous concept of target. Yes. Uh, so it's, it's all already half a meter wider than the target 37. Half a meter? Yes. So it's a big step wow. for anyone. Half a meter more in the in the salon? Yes, all through the boats from the from the stern to the front. Wow. So it's a it's a big it's a big difference. Uh, but then if we compare it with the Targa 44 or Targa 46, mm. it's a, it's only like a five centimeter difference in the hull width. But it's a on a, a 41 you will have around the same beam like the 46. Yes. Oh, la, la. So that's that's uh, that's something that people will really see in appreciate. this boat and appreciate in this boat, which will give a lot more comfort in the fore cabin and in the aft cabin and in all the below deck areas. But I ask you a, a question. It's not a. Uh, it's not a. Um, it's important question. Yes. Uh, your boats are known for being all weather boats because they are uh, uh, not so uh, big in terms of beam than the competitors. If you increase the beam, how can you guarantee to your clients that you will have a very nice uh, way to go through the waves? Well, uh, the Targa 46 is actually an evolution from Targa 44 and yeah. from the beginning from the Targa 42. Yeah. And if, if we compare the, the beam of the new Targa 41 with the old Targa 42, we are very close to the same. So we are still moving in, in uh, known waters, if we say, say that way. So it's, it's, not, it's not a totally different concept than, than okay. what we are used to and safe about. So we, can, we, we are quite safe that this will be a great uh, seaworthy boat also. Yeah, and when you are sailing, anyway, the, the boat, the, the part inside the water is smaller than the, the part... T total uh, beam, yes, total correct. Beam. So it will still be a very seaworthy boat, we are, we are certain about that. And we have done... done uh, uh, um, CMD testing of the hull, so it's, it's, we are quite certain about the performance of the hull. When will we be able to discover the first uh, hull number one? Hull number one will be displayed here at Düsseldorf uh, uh, Boat 24 yeah. uh, as a world premiere uh, yeah. here in, at Boat. How so after exactly one year. One year? Yes. Uh, what are the first reaction of clients? and uh, brand fans when they have discovered two days ago this evolution uh, Robert? We have had a lot of positive feedback so far both from existing clients but also from clients that uh, have 
maybe been looking at the Targa concept before, but not f felt very, totally convinced about the concept. And now, now we attract a lot of interest from their, their side also. So it's been good, good days and good, good feedback and good interest so far. Big challenge at Targa? Big challenge to be in time for, for with yeah. everything, uh, as always with, with the new product development. But uh, we are on, on uh, we are at a good stage at this uh, right now, so we feel quite comfortable with, with the rest also. And this model doesn't replace any other model, it's an addition to the ranch. Yes, it's an addition. Uh, so the tw Targa 37, which we also have here in, in Düsseldorf, yeah. uh, will remain. Uh, the Targa 446 behind us will also remain. Uh, the Targa 44, which we also offer, uh, will uh, slowly be uh, replaced uh, by the 41. But still, at the beginning, they will be side by side offered. But my feeling is that the 41 will be replaced more or less by the 41. Uh, clients who want something bigger than 37, they will go to 41. And next step will naturally be 46. Thank you very much, Robert. Thank you, Nicolas.